So guys, after some time, finally Paranoid Android based on Android version 11 is now available officially for Redmi Note 8 users, Paranoid Android Ruby Alpha 1 version. Let me show you by going here. This is the alpha build, so don't expect much things from this one. Paranoid Android version Ruby Alpha 1 based on Android version 11, which is now available for Redmi Note 8 users. It does not include any bugs by the way, but it has an encryption issue option available. I'm Gonna sh I'm gonna talk about that later on but this one is the latest thing which you get here no customizations we already know about that let's take a quick look at the paranoid Android version 11 so guys, Android 11 is one of the most trending topics nowadays. Android 11 based custom rooms, many custom rooms are available. And if you are looking for Android 11 based custom rooms, this is a quite impressive thing for you. Paranoid Android does not come with many customizations. Many does not suit that even not any single customization. This is kind of a stock Android version 11. If you're looking for a stock Android version 11, this is might be a very good choice for you. This room seems to be really nice. I'm using it from some time now and it's quite good. It's not that much bad. It didn't got any lags at all. As you can see, the touch response is looking good also. And also let me show you one more thing. I've applied the module called Z Touch. So that why that's why the touch response is quite good. Even the performance is a little bit of improved here. This one is the official build, but this one is the alpha one. So just think about that official, but alpha, you can wait for the other builds to be more stable one because it has the major issue. This is a major issue for me, not for everyone. Let me tell you which major issue I'm talking about. If you go for the security and if you go for the advanced option, you can see phone not encrypted. Some people are using DFE disable force encryption for this one. So they don't need to think about that because this is not a bug for them. But for some users like me, this is kind of a bug and this is kind of a serious bug for some users because I sometimes use my device as encrypted one because encrypted one is quite better than the decrypted one. Even my data is safe there. So this is the thing which I was looking for. Phone is not encrypted. This is the thing you need to keep in mind while installing this build but other things seems to be same and same kind of things like which you get in Paranoid Android. Android version 10 was quite same, Android version 11 is quite same so no major changes here. Swipe right as expected the Google Pixel feed. I'm using the Google Apps build here you can use any other build also. Includes all the main things like the notification dots, add app icons to the home screen and same kind of things. And also it comes with the same kind of green kind of ASIN color which was available in the Android version 10 also. But if you're noticing one thing, I've noticed one thing, I'm using the Wi-Fi here and as you can see there's a 4 number written here. This is the thing which was present in Android version 11 first build which was available for Redmi Note 8. So this is kind of a same thing like that one because of this 4 icon is available there. But now this time does not include at this status bar's signal icon which was present in Android version 11, the official stable one, CF based. This one has the Wi-Fi icon which has these numbers available 1, 2, 3, 4. If you didn't like those numbers, then you might not like this th this room also. Other things seems to be same here, abstract which is the default wallpaper app which you get in Paranoid Android where you have some cool kind of wallpapers, collection of wallpapers and one of my favorite wallpapers of course the OnePlus wallpapers which are quite good here. Just click here, click on set wallpaper. It will ask you to choose the home screen, lock screen or both. In my case, I'm going to choose both and updating your wallpaper. It seems to be done. The wallpapers are quite good. Abstract is actually the wallpaper app which is pre-installed but you can install this app manually from the Google Play Store also if you like that. It's all up to you. Camera what I was looking for is a normal Snapdragon camera. This one is simple Snapdragon camera which does not, not include anything, any feature or something like that. But yes, we have the option of choosing the Gcam. I have made a video on Gcam 8.0 also. If you haven't checked it out, you can check out that one and you can give it a try. And if Gcam 8.0 works here, it's quite good. You can use that one. Gcam is quite impressive. Other thing seems to be same. I'm using the latest Magisk version. Wait, let me show which Magisk I'm using. I'm using Magisk 21.0 which is a latest Magisk version. Not actually the proper latest which is 21.1 but 21.0 is also latest 
let me show you my safety net status i don't think so safety net status is passing as you can see safety net status is not passing but yes we have the choice like you can hide the matches by going into settings and click on magic hide also you can simply move here and click on install from storage so, or sorry for that you can simply choose the option of hey, let me show you which module you need for that this one is magic hide props config i have a dedicated video on how you can pass the safety net status on some of the rooms which has this issue not sure if it will work or not but it should work but all these things i just want to let you know are same download android does not come with any customization same kind of things same android version 11 features all android 11 features are available even it does not includes the advanced restart menu which at least should be there because even the pixel experience has that feature but maybe the feature is available in the developer options let me try i haven't checked it out yet sorry for that but i don't think so yes it's not available anywhere even it's not in the google even it's not available in the developer options so as you can see no options available you can simply move here power options are available and the simple restart option does not include the advanced restart options but all these things i just want to let you know i hope you got to know it this was welcome to this video thanks for watching goodbye